Keith Carson is here now, and it was uh, we started off sunny today, then it clouded up, but at least not raining, not gloomy. So we had that going for us. Our standards are low at the moment. Yeah, and uh, we'll get more sunshine uh, statewide tomorrow. Temperatures ended up today in the 40s for the most part, but look at Caribou, 54 degrees, 53 in Holton for a high temperature. So they did pretty well across northern Maine. The rest of us about average for this time of the year. A couple of snow showers possible tonight in the mountains, otherwise quiet. Temperatures at or just a little bit below freezing for our overnight lows. And I think tomorrow is a sunnier day from start to finish when compared to today because we did have those late clouds move in. I don't think we have that problem tomorrow. It stays sunny. Temperatures are similar though, 40 to 45 degrees in most spots. And then Friday is a mixture of sun and clouds with more clouds coming in in the afternoon. And that will be part of an approaching storm system uh, that will start to cloud us up completely on Friday night and then things get more interesting on Saturday. This is the most interesting part of the forecast, so let's talk about it. It's the weekend and the European computer model continues to give us a pretty big storm on Saturday into Saturday night. This thing is wound up. It's cold rain along the coastline with heavy wind and some substantial snow inland and into the mountains. If this were to verify correctly, we'd be looking at six plus inches of snow in a lot of spots here on Saturday night. Now the fly in the ointment is the European model keeps doing its thing and the GFS model keeps doing its thing, which is suppressing the storm more to the south and just giving us a little glancing blow with the storm on Saturday night and into Sunday. My guess is we're going to end up with a bit of a middle ground here. It won't be quite the wrapped up uh, bombogenesis type storm that the Euro is showing, but it won't be as suppressed as far south as uh, this is showing us on Sunday. So I think the net result is likely cold rain along the coastline and some accumulating snow inland and into the foothills. And again, that's Saturday afternoon into Saturday night. Hopefully it gets a little bit more clear here uh, over the next 12 hours or so as to who's going to get accumulating snowfall. It will be windy regardless. And then chilly Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday temperatures there between 30 and 35 degrees in most spots. Pat, usually um, when they're this close, when we're this close to an event, one model doesn't completely win. Mm. So that's why I think we'll ultimately end up with a storm, but it might not be quite the storm that the European thinks. They'll be playing rock'em sock'em robots for the next few days. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> or, or rock, paper, scissors, whatever. They get to settle it somehow. <laughs> Thank you, Keith.